Hello everybody and welcome back to AGP. We're back with some more Stardew Valley. Yes, I know about the lightning storms. We have a lot to do today. Not a lot of time to goof off. And the bookseller is in town, which is good for us. Can you believe we are already at the point now where we are halfway through summer? Like, how did that even happen? So, today the bookseller's in town. So, I would like to go see the bookseller. Ooh. You know what? We're going to upgrade a tool, too, while we're at it. Aw, Mayor Lewis gave me 500 Gs just for being part of the community. Isn't that sweet? So, let me get my chores done so we can get a rockin' and get a starting. And I will see you guys in a few. Alright, chores are done. It's time to go. We need some crops for our farm. We want to give out some gifts. We want to go check out the bookseller. We want to upgrade our axe. And we want to get the geo process. So let's not waste any time. An iron bar for Robin. I can easily do that because she will be at my place. So that takes 12, which we don't have time. We only have technically nine days. So no, no, no. You know what? We're just going to be safe. We're just going to buy wheat. I can use wheat in the next season too. So it works out for me. We almost got busted. Have I already given you two gifts? No, I have not. Fantastic. Yes, I'm sure it's a trouble living on the beach. Mayor Lewis, 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 Mayor Lewis. I've already given you two gifts. You can fuck off then. I will take that coal. Every day. Hey, can you process a geo for me? You can. Great. Well, look at that. That's fantastic. Uh, You're going to go ahead and you're going to upgrade my axe. Thank you. And then I'm going to give this to you. I just gave you a tool to upgrade, dude. Seriously. What is this problem? I'm going to donate this to the museum. Fabby. Oh, this cutscene. Oh. It's sad, but I love it so much. It really shows that if you choose little man boy to end up being your husband, that he's actually really great with kids. He's got a really soft spot for them. He's kind of childish at heart, but he always has like his little brother's attention. So he would make a really great dad. Hello, man. And I say, isn't it? It really is. I'm just keeping an eye on my little brother. It's good for him to get some fresh air on a day like this. Yes, it is. Our dad used to take us to the beach on sunny days like this. See him? Is dad ever going to come home? <gasps> of course, Vince. Dad's going to come back as soon as he possibly can. But I hear some grown-ups saying that all of our troops are getting shot to pieces. <laughs> Don't believe everything you hear. Don't you remember how strong Dad is? He's never going to let a pathetic Go Gotoro grunt get him like that. Don't you worry. And always remember, the Mom and I are here to play with you, even if you're feeling lonely. Okay. I don't know why when he's playing, he looks so depressed. Amanda, to be honest, I have no idea if my male man will come back. We've all read the, the reports. Our soldiers are fallen by the thousand. But what am I going to say to Vincent? Okay. I honestly don't know what the right answer is. And I honestly don't care what the right answer is. Because me personally... This is the right answer. Vincent does not need to be told anything else until news breaks that his dad had an accident. Until then, you got to keep the kids' hopes up that their parents are going to be okay because it's it's just it, it would be too much for a kid. So, he did the right thing. Kids should have hope. Yeah, kids should play and have fun while they still have a chance. Exactly. 
Hey, did I tell you the band's starting to come together? Yeah, it turns out Abigail's a pretty good drummer. Sebastian seemed to really want her in the band. I'm sure he did. Lucky her. Haley, perfect timing. You can get bopped, I know. Wow, look, wow, it looks like someone read the latest issue of Super Fashion Girl. Muddy boots are totally in right now. I ought to smack you. I might as well collect all these things, you know? You know what? I'm going to go sell these corals to Willie and give him his gift. I know I want to go to the mines, but man, I'd really like to get these gifts done and over with. Oh, a rainbow shell. Nice. I need one of those. Oh, Willie, get poppin'. Don't worry, I'm an expert. And if you could take this, 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 and this, I'd greatly appreciate it. Bye. Oh. Weren't you just leaving the beach? Okay, princess, what's up? Amanda, come here quick. My bracelet's gone. I, I know I had it on when I got here. But now it's gone, and I can't find it anywhere. Okay. Well, I looked left and right. I can't find it. I'll never find another one like it. Relax, I'll just buy you a new one. I don't think so. Look, I'm, I'm sorry you lost your bracelet, kid. Maybe it'll wash up on another shore. I can't bear to think of it at the bottom of the ocean. Or around a fish's neck. This is why you don't wear jewelry to the beach. Sorry, Great Grandma. I lost your precious bracelet. Please, you, you brought your Great Grandmother's bracelet to the fucking... You stupid. <coughs> you don't wear makeup to the beach. You don't wear jewelry to the beach. Oi. Could she have dropped it nearby? Well, since the camera moved, and this is the only thing now on the beach, I'm going to say yes. Is that? You found it. Um... Thank you so much, Amanda. You're a lifesaver. You're welcome. Oh, look at her blush. I won't forget what you did for me here. I found a bracelet and handed it to you. It's really not big of a, not that big of a deal. Oh, good. Jazz is here. And so is little Vincent. So we can bop Jazz. I know you're now done. Let's bop Vincent. I know. No. No, I'm not as boring as most grown-ups. Oh, dear God, it is like cutscene day. Hey, Amanda. Hi, Gus. What's going on? I'm just sitting here looking over last month's earnings, and I'm going to be honest with you, Amanda, it's not looking very good. The worst thing, and I really hate to say this because she is my friend, it's Pam. She hasn't paid off a tab in weeks. But how am I supposed to ask her to do it? I know she'll get defensive. And I don't want to hurt her feelings, you know what I'm saying? Amanda, is, can you give me some advice? Is there any way you can help me? Oh, we'll speak of the devil. Hiya! Gus, I'm awfully thirsty if you catch my drift. Uh, well, okay, Pam. Amanda, what's going on here? Okay. So, in all honesty, if it was me, I yell at her, your tab needs to be paid right now. Do you have any idea the fact that you're just freeloading off of Gus? And how wrong that is. But. 
you will lose 50 friendship points with Gus if you do it that way. Because remember, he doesn't want to hurt her feelings. So the right thing that you need to say here is actually the saloon isn't doing well financially. You'll get 15 friendship points. Yes, Pam gets a little upset, but she pays off her tab and Gus gives her the drink. It isn't. That's terrible. Oh. Well, I guess I better pay off that tab then. Oh, so you just happen to have the money. Ugh. Thanks, Pam. And thank you, Amanda. No problem. Now let's get you that drink, Pam. Oh, Emily's not here yet. Okay, gotta go. Oh, here she comes. And get bop. Thank you. I'm gonna put this under my pillow and hopefully I'll dream about the ocean. I consider the bees and butterflies to be my special friends. Of course you do. Oh, we wanted to check out the book guy. I don't have the money for the book guy. What's the point? Penny's here. And get bopped. Thank you. I really love this. I've been teaching Jazz and Vincent about dwarvish archaeology. Jazz is curious about the origins of the dwarves, but Vincent is mainly interested in dwarvish weapons. You know what? That's cool of them. And you found a topic that they're both interested in. Good job, Penny. We may make a teacher out of you yet. There you are. Wow. The office closes at 3 and you don't get out till like 5.30? Dude, that sucks. Sir, I was just thinking about some gadgets I'm making. I've decided I'm going to build a robot someday. Okay, so with this one, you can. This one does affect friendship. You could go, that should be very easy for you. Which it really should be for her. You should be more realistic. Or it sounds challenging. This one gives you plus 30 friendship. This one's minus 50. And this one's 40. So, I want the extra friendship, so I'm going to say it sounds challenging just for that extra 10 friendship. You're right, but I love a challenge. If you say it's really easy, she'll say stuff to like, are you trying to, are, really? Are you just trying to flatter me? So, it's kind of cute. Let's get us down another five levels, maybe. We'll try it. Let's dig a little deeper. So, I'm just going to do the mines. I'll bring you back if I find anything good. All right, we are done with the mines, but again, we have way too much inventory or we don't have enough inventory space for all the inventory, so we're going to have to run back to the house, get some stuff, organize, and come back for the rest of it. But we didn't do too bad. We got a solar essence, we got a bomb, we got a topaz, we got an, an amethyst. Did I already get that? Yeah, cool. I can sell that. We got 13 iron, which means that we're going to have at least two more iron bars. And we're going to close our doors. So let me go ahead, get this stuff organized, and I will bring you guys back in just a minute. Alright, it's already 12 o'clock and I haven't gone back to the rest of the stuff, so I'm drinking this coffee so I can run. So I'll be back in a minute. Alright, I got everything. I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. I need to check to see what Robin wanted, but it doesn't matter, I gotta go to bed. Whoo, I'm going to hit. It's going to hit tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow's going to be bad. I'm going to take such an energy hit. Man, that mayonnaise, though, and that cheese, brah. Crystal fruit's 165G. That's interesting. <laughs> all right, it's a cart lady day. It doesn't matter. I'm going to the mines. We all know I am because I don't have an axe. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do is... I'm pretty much, I do want to go down to see the wizard and give him a gift because I have not gifted the wizard a damn thing. Oh, are you kidding me? I have my five corn. Yo, let's go. And I guess we're going to the community center. Oh, iron bar. Robin wanted an iron bar. So I could give that to her. Clint just taught me algae soup. Emily taught me red plate. And Marnie gave me hay. And trust me, you can't have enough hay in this game. So I'm going to quickly get my chores done. And then we're going to gift give. Oh, it's Demetrius's birthday. And I'll be back in just one moment. All right, guys, chores are done. We're heading over to go see the cart lady right now. Hey, Sweet Pea, how you doing? No, 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 no. 
Oh, I like that table. But no, I'll take the rare C though. I'm not ready to even start decorating yet. My house is too small. Let's go see the wizard. Hey, you. Get bopped. Same as always. Alright, let's... Let's head down to the beach real quick. What the hell is this? Wait! This weekend, the summer 20 through the 21st, come prove your freshwater skills and win prizes. Any personal items found near this sign will be sent to the lost and found. Oh yeah, the trout thing is tomorrow. We get to do that. Yeah, baby. Which actually means I don't really want to. If I end up doing that all day, then I don't get to go foraging. So, change of plans. We're going foraging today. Alex, you're the first one I see, so you get it, buddy. You're welcome. What do you want? I've got more important things to do right now. Oh, of course you do. Clint, this is for you. Yes, this is exactly what I've been looking for. The weather doesn't really matter to me. Depressing, huh? Yep. Alright, so since we're going foraging now, I'm going to kind of go up, down, come back. I'm going to go all the way up through the mountains. Oh, I can't get any... <clears throat> no, I have to go mining because I don't have my axe. Damn it. Oh, well. Let's head back down and go get Willie his thing. Hey, Willie. Got something for you. Get bopped. This looks great. Thank you. Tomorrow's the annual trout derby. I. it's a freshwater enthusiastic, enthusiasm stream. Uh-huh, sure. Whatever you say, Willie. Okay, so we'll hit Demetrius for his birthday. We'll put our corn in the bundle. And then we'll give Robin her... Oh, no, because everybody's about to start heading towards the... That's right, that's right, that's right, that's fine. I can still do this. Besides, I wanted to give Gus his gift anyway. So I can gift Gus, I can hit Robin, I can hit Demetrius, and I can be done. And then I'll be able to get maybe five levels into the mines. Here you go, Gus. That's very sweet of me. I'm glad business is good for you. Excuse me. Hey, sexy. Oh, hey. Oh, sorry. It's alright, I understand. Now, both Robin and Demetrius come down this trail. There's Robin. Hey! That's the armbar. Here's a little stuff for each. Oh, I got the trophy. Or the gopher. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, because I got to get your husband, too. Actually, I want to get him from behind. That sounded bad. Hey, a present with optimal timing. Today's the anniversary of my birth. No one talks like that. So I hear Maru had to look through that. I heard Maru had you look through that telescope out back. Yep. Jealous. She's your daughter. We're friends. I don't know why you're making a big deal out of this. Oh, and give me the money. Five levels. We just need five levels. Well, I got an Omni Geode. But I'm still on the first level and I haven't found stairs at all. There we go. Yeah, I am only on the third level. It's now 10 o'clock and it's infested. So I'm going to fight this ghost because hopefully it'll drop a ghost fish maybe. Or some more gold. And then I'm done. Nope, just a solar essence. I'm out. This game didn't give me shit today. I know sometimes when it says it's bad luck, it's actually bad luck. But damn. Alright everybody, we got everything taken care of, everything is now being put away, and it is time for bed, and of course, as always, I want to thank everybody for watching, don't forget if you want to help out the channel, like, subscribe if you're not subscribed, remember it is free to do, leave a comment down below because all that helps the algorithm and helps out the channel, and I'll see you all on the next one, we get to do our first Trout Derby, let's go!